react properly and DI it on such a quick throw. But we're going to swipe right over to another round of winners. Another I'd swipe game right of on winners numbers. round three. <laughs> the new ship, MJ and numbers. What do we got? Uh, <laughs> M jumpers. M jump jumpers. <laughs> Wait. M J. Well, I mean, I. MJ on numbers. MJ, you could honestly combo him with so much power couple potential. That's all I'll say. Uh. Oh, infinitely so. MJ, can do you see yeah. this robot? Mm. Mm. All right. <laughs> I have so, so this... many things. I have so many follow-ups I could say to that, and I'm not going to say yeah. any of that. Nope, we're done. Uh, we're we're yeah. done with this one. <laughs> <We're good. laughs> Anyway, yeah, we do have John Numbers versus MJ. This is going to be Rob versus We Fit. Now, one thing worth noting here, uh, We Fit, uh, sorry, John Numbers has a lot of experience against Rob just because Dill is, you know, a staple New York player. Both of them are. So definitely he's probably not going to get caught off guard by any of like, a, I didn't know Rob could do that. But there is still the potential of, I didn't know MJ would go for that. Yeah, if MJ, MJ's breed of Rob at the very least is kind of a 50-50 between how many Rob players can act. Like he hasn't been going for anything ridiculous like uh, like Rob players like Zombo will do. Like where they'll just really hard commit to the ridiculous edge guards and super early kills. He plays a lot of neutral. But then he'll have these moments where it's like, alright, I'm just gonna ledge trap you forever. I'm gonna like cover so many options in the blink of an eye. But with an experienced eye like numbers to to get around tools and more particularly utilize the ledge to an infinite degree, we're gonna have to see how well MJ uh, wins the battle on stage and how much he can take advantage of that. Uh, and he's it's starting out good so far. MJ looking pretty good here as you just stated 118 percent on his first stock though john numbers now has to think about how he's going to get this kill and we fit trainer definitely has kill potential but uh if a rob is if anybody is sneaky enough it can still be really tricky right there though being able to just space outside of i believe he whiffed a grab right there and numbers reacted accordingly shooting the sun directly into his face like a dyson sphere and that's going to be evened up stock count Dyson Sphere. Mm, that's a, that's a I'm pretty sure that's like the sci-fi thing of like, we now use energy by eating the sun. Yeah, I, I believe that is correct. Thank you. <laughs> I just, listen, I, 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 I was just like, yesterday somebody was talking to me about Dyson Spheres. I got them in my head. You, you're not allowed to judge me. I'm legally. not. I'm, I, it just made me, it made me remember, uh, again, nerdy uh, reference, but I remembered a a Yu-Gi-Oh card called uh, Dyson Sphere, which is quite literally a giant space station wrapped around the sun. So, you know, I think you're correct. <laughs> anyway, we're now, getting... I want to dwell on this Yu-Gi-Oh card more. Um, no, no, we're so going we have... to focus on the, we're going to focus on the match a little bit as Numbers finds himself, uh, well, at least for the moment, he was lapped in percent by MJ, who's been holding center stage so firmly, even with the... Uh, the amount of utility that we fit has with this deep breathing you're just dead Ooh. no you're not thank you deep breathing <laughs> yeah the deep breathing does give a bit of a uh, uh like a defense buff in terms of redu is it reduced damage or reduced knockback both it is both yeah so that was definitely enough to save john numbers right there but will it be enough for because he needs to save himself he can't rely on deep breathing in order to actually turn this match around well, it'll be a big part of it but still has to definitely find some way to earn the win as i say that beautiful air dodge managing to avoid every single one of those rob up air hits and now numbers actually starting to come alive here 62 percent on mj but one really strong hit is all he needs i like actually numbers sticking by the ledge meaning that down tilt will not lead into any uh, sort of kill and this is getting a little bit spooky, and MJ has to have so much respect for numbers throwing out stuff here. Uh, the sun salutation, of course, will could kill with a deep breathing, and that you know, is he dead? Yeah, he is. Oh. Wow! Speak of the devil, that deep breathing sun salutation out Rob's Nair. Normally, Rob Nair very safe move, very big hitbox, very good. But I mean, you saw that deep breathing just. Uh, sorry, rather, Sun Salutation just absolutely chunked it 
Unless I'm completely wrong and he didn't neutral air. No, he did. Okay. Yeah. Super safe, but then he looked to dash back. Oh, he waited no, he out. Did it again. Oh, no, it was the back air. Oh, yeah, yeah. So he went. Interesting. Yeah, yeah. Just you have to respect the uh, effective range that we Fit Trainer has when she uh, wants to just throw out a sun salutation like that. This is what I mean when we see the experience on ledge of numbers, not even just like literally in ledge hang, but also just manipulating the neutral getup and just knowing like, okay, I can wait for a little bit here. If I feel pressured, I can just run back off and grab ledge. I can throw out some, something like header, which by the way, if you were unaware, header got five frames shaved off of it in terms of end lag. So it's what? even safer than it was now yeah it was a shadow buff in the previous patch not in reference but it is a massive change for we fit that makes an already phenomenal move wait, that so much better wait when you say shot do you mean five frames was chopped off because like they decreased the hit lag or because they just removed the end lag on the move it was five frames of less end lag that wasn't referenced in the patch notes huh yeah Oh, but you're dead, so it's <laughs> fine. <laughs> yeah, the power to the backroom deals you've done at Nintendo. <laughs> Unless you buff it so that Wii Fit Trainer doesn't die. There, this character's scary now. I mean, we, we saw... He's dead. He's dead. <laughs> okay, I just want to dwell on the fact that last match, I think the first stock went after maybe a minute and a half, if not more. And in 30 seconds... Both players have just absolutely decimated each other. We are on Smashville. I, I don't think Smashville is the reason those two stocks <laughs> happen. I don't, can... think, I don't think there's like a sign on Smashville that says like murder is okay here. Uh, you know, maybe. <laughs> Could be, perhaps. I, I'm, what I mean is more acutely at the very least is the center platform is so promising for Wii Fit's uh, combo game since she already pops people up at a pretty awkward either straight up or 45 degree angle. So pressure on this platform is really huge for her. But yeah, no, Rob down airing at ledge is a tale as old as time. Will he do it again? As old as Brawl. Uh, yeah, well, that's that's pretty old. That Thanks, is pretty Wintry, old. For I'm pretty sure follow. time itself started with Brawl. You know, like, yeah. like the world came into existence, a Latin music sprung in the background, and we had Smash Brawl, with starring Rob and his crazy down air. <laughs> Rob, the ancient Recent minister. <laughs> Rob, the grand minister Rob, with his with the, the book of the gyro, as he almost takes Numbers' second stock in a pretty uh, situationally effective setup thanks to that gyro. Is he? No, he didn't have deep breathing on, so no kill throws without it. Oh, Rob main grab ledge. It's an infinite. Oh, okay, he got stuffed. <laughs> All right, now I want. Do you want to like focus a little bit? Think about the the mental sort of position that MJ is in. You start off that game with a zero to death, completely, absolutely destroying numbers at the start. And all of a sudden, now you're down to your last stock and you're struggling to. Granted, he picked it up right there, but. I'm sure we've all had that experience when you're playing against someone you really want to win and you get a super early stock and you're like, I have this. This is my game. I, this is in the bag. And then all of a sudden it's slipping away from you and you're like, what did I do wrong? I'm sorry for my hubris. I mean, just look at it right here. While neutral air is incredibly safe, he's pro been providing numbers a lot more respect on ledge, which I mean, exclamation point numbers in chat. Ledge is indeed friend. But I really want to talk about just a little bit how well Numbers has controlled Gyro because that's kind of what Jay Grunt was trying to do in his previous in the uh, previous set we saw MJ on stream but Jay Grunt always countered the Gyro Numbers in this case has been grabbing it and using it to his own advantage whether it be to extend combos throwing it straight up and waiting there it is <laughs> waiting for it to fall back down uh, he's had magnificent control to the point where MJ has had basically one opportunity to use it offensively, and he just can't get down. Yeah, really solid game from numbers there. That game one looked really dangerous for him. He ended up managing to get the comeback. Game two started off looking like an absolute... Just it, I thought it was going to be a bloodbath, but no, just 
calmly keeps his head in the game, makes those really big plays. And at the end there, look at this gyro use. Oh, the way he throws it down, knows that the bounce is going to actually connect and then manages to use that. Look at that. He cuts off the entire middle space there, forces Rob to go to that exact location and meets him there with a meaty, meaty back air. Yeah, it was phenomenal. Just he created a line that said, hey, you don't cross this line. And as soon as he tried to once he knew that uh, J, excuse me, MJ would be trying to DI in to get back to center. I mean, Rob's relatively heavy. It was far too close. It's far too low for him to do it safely. And numbers very like just picked him out of the sky with that back air.